Hello and welcome to my video about IGCSE maths. So before you start, it's worth knowing that in year nine and before, we designed the curriculum to help you make the best start for your IGCSE. So it's designed to prepare you in which that there are some topics that you will have seen before and that we build upon um, in order to give you the practice that you need. However, if you've joined halfway through the year or you join us from a different school, that's okay because we do start fresh in year 10 and the early units um, establish the arithmetic and algebra skills um, it, that you need in order to thrive on the course. So, the course that we study is Cambridge, code 0580. And there are four strands of mathematics that we look at, similar to what you do currently. So those topics are number, algebra, shape, and data. So the number topics are here. And most of these you will have seen already before and that you do currently in year nine. For example, fractions, decimals, percentages, standard form, multiples and factors. So we would build upon those that you already have. Algebra topics. Again, some of these that you'll recognize and some of these will be new. And more algebra topics here. For example, differential calculus, which we do at the end of year 11 and some more complex ideas of applying algebra in different situations. The shape topics, things to do with angles, volumes and areas, symmetries, trigonometry, and vectors. The data topics are all about working with data, producing diagrams and calculating statistics on those data. Also looking at probability. So Cambridge offer two tiers. One is the extended curriculum in which the majority, if not all KIS students will follow. Some students that find this too challenging will opt for the core curriculum. The core curriculum is a reduced version of the extended curriculum and the top grade for that is a grade C. At the end of the course, you will sit two exams at the end of year 11. The extended tier is two papers which are two hours each, a total four hours. And one paper will be calculator and one paper will be non-calculator. So everybody at KIS has to do IGCSE maths and it is an accessible course, but there will be some challenges. So students who do well on the course are students who have a positive attitude towards the subject, are well organized, are prepared to work hard and complete all the tasks set and involve their teacher. So that is ask questions, listen to their teacher and follow their teacher's advice. So if you have any further questions about the IGCSE maths, please let me know or speak to your maths teacher. Thank you.